Hey you guys, bingo, look. There is a vintage pixie in that bag. Hi, hi you guys, it's Yvonne. We are back to the Christmas raid hit and runs where I just try to hit as many thrift stores as possible and just look at Christmas stuff. Everything is half price today except for yellow. So a lot of it will be yellow. She's kind of cute. $4.99. Yeah, I'm gonna hold out for better prices. There's so many thrift stores for me to hit. So I'll throw a couple together in each video, like I said. That looks new, but I just like it. It's got a little matching spoon. Repaired. That was kind of cute. You can put the lights in it. Christmas clown. <laughs> Let's see, these fuzzies. I just sold a couple last night, but you know, not for very much. So I want to get them really, really affordable. <sighs> Be cute for assemblage. Okay, let's come up. Just really looking for the cute, cute, or the vintage. Every thrift store is so stocked right now. Christmas 2002, okay, no. With their Christmas stuff, so. Wait a minute, free instructions inside. Oh, it's a doll, okay. No, I don't wanna do dolls. Let's come up, more figurines. Music, music box. The window's behind here, so it might be a little hard to see for just this row. And then I'll turn around. Is this a Catherine's collection? Let me see. I think it's just one of the copies. Not too bad though. <laughs> These are definitely vintage. I wish this was in better shape. It's only $1.29 though. Darn, she's so messed up though, bummer. This might be handmade pottery. It is. <laughs> I think we will pass on all the Inesco cherished teddies. Teacher Avon. Christmas raccoon. <laughs> Hi Nick. Knickknacks. <laughs> Nick of knickknacks. Kind of gives raccoons more meaning. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna flip around. Okay. Take the pottery piece back here. Hmm. Not too bad. Lots of cheaper resin figurines. Birdhouse. Uh oh, minis, that's what I like. $2.99 for three of them. Not on sale, but yeah. I don't know if you guys can see. It's like a cat and kangaroo. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's see this little derpy thing. Something's missing. <laughs> I'm sorry, little turtle. Not sure what happened to you. I do like my flocked stuff. Dollar ninety-nine, yeah. Flocked bunny bank. I'm a big fan of the flocked stuff. Big fan. Oh, wish you weren't all messed up but I see some pottery underneath you. So let's check this out. I don't think I'm gonna love it. That's been here forever. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I'm gonna love that color. Here's some vintage glass. No, that's not vintage. Nope, that's plastic. Made to look like vintage art glass. 
Dang, I keep looking at you. <laughs> Still gonna pass. It's a vintage ashtray. I wonder if that's a Blanco or something. Hmm. It's so dirty though. I'm, I'm gonna pass. It smells like cigarette smoke. Oh, these are cute, yeah. 1978 Pentron. There's like, um, it matches those containers. What is happening here? <laughs> Let's see. What? IRS picnic. I have no idea what's going on here. Six out of 50. That's unusual, isn't it? That's kind of sweet. I don't do a lot of this style, but that's pretty sweet looking. Oh, I might do that because it's half price. Cookies, three dollars a piece. Okay, listen, we're not gonna talk about it. <laughs> I had to like put you in my pocket. The Christmas aisle got crazy, and people don't like it when you're filming. I might get this bait bucks bank. It will be half price. It's kind of different. Didn't show you this weirdo. I'll save for train to Trippyville. No price on it though. And yes, found my raku for the day. But I'm open to finding more. And then down in here, I've got a little prosperity tree with an elephant on it. This is only $7.99. It's worth way more than that. I'm upside down. I know you guys. Hang on. Okay, there. That's a big one. Well, medium sized one. Hey, that's not mine. What is that? Singer song. Okay. And then I do kind of like this hand painted plaque from Mexico. I do like that. It's only $4.99. Yeah, I like that. I think I will get that. So, um, just let me run through the rest of the hard goods real quick. You guys can do these end caps. Thanksgiving. Pass on that. Somebody put gravel in here. Let me just double check it. Nah. Home goods. Bill Long. It's one of our car dealerships. All right. Oh, I can always use more of these. 99 cents. Heck yeah. That's a good deal. You guys know this would be like about $10 or more, even at um, Walmart. All right, store number two for thrift store Christmas raid <laughs> hit and runs. This is for me. I know these are new, but I just love them. And this one's only $1.99. So nice and quick, see what we have. Might have time to hit another one and squeeze it into this video. Nice homemade partial nativity scene set. That looks a little older. I think that one is a little older. Looks like little home cos. Okay, turning the corner. Turning, turning. <laughs> Flip side. Could use some. That's a nice foliage for projects. I think the bins would be the best place for that. Those aren't really vintage. Now that looks a little more vintage. That does. 
Wish it was like cranberries though instead. And we do need to check the little packages. Too much broken. Sorry you guys. I know it was hard for you to even see in there. Remember quick hit and runs. Trying to cram in as many as possible. <laughs> Open mind though. Open mind. Nope. Flip side. They are cute. That's an eighties thing, isn't it? Made in China, nine ninety nine. It's just cute. these little pieces you make a village set wish they were just a little older let's check out this shell those sell but that one's not very cool is it cookie set it's only a dollar ninety-nine. See Christmas story cookie set, yeah. Nativity cookies. Tins. Little bulb diorama. <laughs> nope. Won't bother even look. Okay. So here's where they put all the tins that were in that basket. Hmm. Let's bypass. Well, that was all for the special Christmas aisles. The only thing I added are these. They're vintage, made in USA from Hallmark. Um, there's four sheets. They're just precious little retro vintage things. So four of you will get a sheet of these. <laughs> Look at the little praying angels. Get that when I ship out your orders. All right, let's do hard goods real quick. And then I am on to the next one. I will definitely have time because this was pretty easy. My mom wants a ship because she came over in a ship. Wait a minute, let's see who this is. Okay, games, Olympic Games, Los Angeles 84. I wonder who, okay, here, tell me who that is. Not going to, made in USA. I should, I do okay with Olympic stuff online. Should probably do that. See these little crystal candle things. Faceted. All right. Cruising, cruising. Just hard goods. There's somebody's project, let's have fun. Crazy things you find at the thrift store. Beer bottle. <laughs> Man, they took some broken jewelry. Kind of like a memory jar, sort of. Oh, that's a vintage elephant. Are you in good shape? Oh my gosh, does that say you were at Woolworth for like 97 or 47 cents? Wow, do you know how old that would make this thing? Too bad it's got a broken horn. Guys, cause, wait a minute, let me set it up, because that... That is old. Oh, wait a minute. That's Italian. $2.99. There's a lot of things that go with this. I can't remember what it's called. I'll throw it up. It's not worth a whole lot, but people might be missing that from their set. <laughs> Never trust people who don't like cats. Some people are just allergic. They're not trying to be mean. They're just allergic. Okay, that's an assemblage. And so is that. That's all glued together. <laughs> okay. Quick peruse on the other side at faces. It's, I don't think I'm gonna get lucky today. Nope. OK, 
Okay, I want to cruise furniture before I go. Furniture and lamps. A little vintage boudoir lamp. It's actually only $3.99. Needs a vintage shade rather than the new shade. Let's look at furniture. Oh, wait a minute, I see more Christmas stuff. Okay, yes, it's more Christmas stuff over there. Hang on, awesome. I was wondering where they put all the ornaments. That is kind of made in Taiwan. This is eight, uh, 90s. How much is that? Acrylic. If it was glass, that'd be a no-brainer. I dropped it. I'll pick it up. Oh, that's cute. Fine porcelain. That's pretty, isn't it? Angel watching over. <laughs> There's a deer. It's just a deer head. All right, I gotta pick this up. Okie doke. I think I see something. What's this? It's closing a pair of sunglasses. Closing a sunglass ornament. <laughs> well, that's different. It would actually, it would actually only be a dollar too. But I just, I don't know if anybody'd be here for it, <laughs> right? <laughs> Other side of ornaments. Someone crocheted an ornament. Okay, hello. They crocheted a cozy. There's a beaded one with fluffies. Hey, I don't have a black deer. What are you, two ninety nine? I don't have a black deer. It's another felt. Okay, I don't think I see anything. Hey, you guys, bingo! Look, there is a vintage. Pixie in that bag. I gotta get that bag off. I'm not even gonna let go of it. Hang on. <laughs> okay, I got it. There it is. <laughs> Cute little pixie. Probably keep that. Definitely worth the $3.99 bag. That's all I care about in there. And I don't think I've ever seen a black Christmas tree. How much are you? $40. It's a skinny mini. Nice little apartment size. Okay, that was the Christmas hit and run for here. Next stop, I don't know if I'll add it to this or it'll be the next in the series. I'll talk to you guys later. Hi, hi you guys, it's Yvonne. I am doing my series of thrift store Christmas speed shopping. And I think I'm done for today. I've hit about five and it's just not gonna get any better than this. So I think I'll call it good. I'll talk to you guys later.